Hey you guys, what's cracking? My name's Brody Amity and I'm back here today with box number 6, part number 2 of my Roaring Skies case opening. And like I said in the last video, it's a very, very sad day. So I'm going to get straight to it without further ado. And let's go through these last 11 packs. Last 11 packs. So yeah, continuation from the topic of the last part. Uh, if, if you guys know of anywhere cheaper to buy these packs in Australia, even if it's like a yeah, toy world, if you just go in stores and they let you buy cases from them, or a distributor, anything like that, I'd love to know. I would love to know. Because, yeah, the, uh, the openings on my channel all depend on the price because, as you know, it's not, not very cheap to buy these. I try, I think price-wise, I try to buy these for 3 three thirty a pack, which ends up, yeah, being around about $130 per box on eBay, I think, in Australian dollars, so $150. Straight off the bat, so it's not cheap. Not cheap at all. But yeah, over the three month period, I allocate allocate the funds to go towards these openings from work, from my work. But yeah, it's all good, yeah. So I'm trying to, trying to open up all I can and I just spread it out over the time period. So these could, um, this is actually getting recorded probably like a month after I purchased the case. Just um, delaying things a little bit, trying to enjoy it and make it last. So we got a reverse rare Articuno and a Skarmory regular rare. Yeah, I tried to, I, I picked, up, picked up this hobby probably like August, September, October last year. Been been collecting since I was younger. Lost my collection. Um, take a wild start and save my parents through them out because they sat in a binder on the top of my cupboard. Not getting played with, obviously. But yeah, I picked it back up at around Plasma Blast last year. That's another rare, that's a Burnett, and a Dust of Ancient Trade. Yeah, I picked, picked it back up at around Plasma Blast, and I've been going pretty strong since then. Completed, completed Plasma Blast, uh, Legendary Treasures, base XY Base Set, Flash Fire, Furious Hiss, and I'm in the process of completing Phantom Forces, Primal Clash, and now skies as well which is always fun so, and by completing I mean the the complete set plus all the reverses as well so it's a complete complete set not including all promos I don't don't really tend to collect the promos they're just on the side like all the tin so that's another reverse rare skarmory and a dragonite a regular rare. Yeah, I don't really. I've, I've never really opened tins too too much since I've got back into it. Which I probably should. I probably should appreciate them a lot more. If you have not seen my very first tin I opened on YouTube, it was not bad at all. It was not bad at all. The pull, the pull. That's what I'll say. I'll leave it there. You, you guys will just have to go check that one out. The pull was sweet. Sweet, sweet. Alrighty. And so, yeah, we've been pretty dud so far, but we have Electro, Swablu, Bagon, Execute, Fletchling, Tranquil, Wally, Silcoon, Binacle Reverse. I I'm, I'm not going to say anything. I'm not going to say anything. And Togekiss Hollow. So, yeah, just as I say that, look at the shine. Serene Grace and Fairy Moon. Yeah, just as I was saying, we have not got anything yet. I get a nice. Pretty take this hollow. Call as sort these out quickly. 
So yeah, I've been doing a new thing with uh, with these openings. Um, what do you guys think of the little flash on the screen of the card and then into the light? Let me know in the comment section what you guys think of that. And how, like, if, if you guys don't like it, let me know why and um, maybe an idea of how I could improve it. But we've got Togepi, Fletchling, Execute, Taylor, Mega Turbo, Winona, Unpheasant, Natu Reverse, and a regular rare Bannet with Psy Shot. Cool, cool. Look at that. That's how they should open, just nice and clean through the top. Alrighty, here we go. About time, about time. This uh, box picked this game up in part number two. We have Voltol, Inkay, Barnacle, Halucha, Cascoon, Red Quasar Spiritling, Tranquil, Gliscoll, Cascoon Reverse. That's, that one's an uncommon. No, that one's a common. The Cascoon's an uncommon, I'm pretty sure. And a colorless Rayquaza. Rayquaza, Rayquaza. Intensifying Burn and Dragon Pulse. So yeah, that's not a bad pull at all. Can never have too many of those ones. The art on that one, I do prefer a lot better over the Dragon type. Any day. Absolutely any day. Mega Ladio. So yeah, um, have you guys been taking notes of the packs that have been getting the pulls? Because not only am I weighing, weighing these for you guys to kind of just, just for speed purposes, but I'm also letting you guys see what packs to go for in the shops, if you know what I'm saying. So yeah, just keep an eye out and keep tally of those, those sorts of things. Because when you go to buy them, just pick, pick one that got like a full art in my video and you may, may get one yourself. So yeah, that one is the uncommon. Like I, like I was saying just before, shop it with black and Zekrom Hollow. So that's the second one of this box, which is very strange. Very strange. I'm not really too big a fan of how they do that. There's plenty of other cards that could be put into the box, but then they put a double up. Hello. Interesting. Interesting. Nintendo. Pokemon. Whoever makes the cards. Haven't looked into it that much. Okay. We got Togepi. Ninkator. Dunsparce. Wingull. Tratini. Skyfield. Rayquaza. Gliscor. Ultra Ball Reverse. And a Swallow Hollow. Cool. So I'm guessing hollows are going to be a theme for this box. Just checking. So we've got five hollow rares so far. We have five ultra rares so far. Interesting. Interesting. And the final pack for this part. Well, actually. Actually. We got, we got f one, two, three, four, five, and one, two, three, four, five. So no, this will not be the final pack because I'm gonna go hunting for the twelfth one. I'm going to go hunting. So this will not be the final pack for this opening. But we have Electro. Bagon, Ninkator, Pedove, Dunsparce, Fletchender, Altaria, Wildlands, Gallade Spirit Link, and a Beautify Hollow. Yeah, so definitely one of the more dud boxes of this case. But I would definitely see you guys in a moment once I hunt out that final, final Hollow Rare for this box.
Alrighty, and I'm back, and I've came down to this pack being the final one of this part. If I do not find it in this pack, I will tweet it. I'll tweet out the picture of the card. But I believe we have not found it. But we've got Spiro, Natu, Shuppet, Dustox, Wally, Winona, Dragonite, Ancient Track, Reverse Rare, and an Unfizzle. Interesting, interesting, interesting. Actually, I'm gonna have a effort moment. Effort. And let's just keep going. We're hunting for it. There's no ifs or buts about it. It's happening. It is happening. Here's a uh, code card for you guys that have uh, hung out. in the last pack of this box, so this is what I would have done off camera. And you guys that have hung around through this boring, very very boring part of the opening, to see we have a Voltal, Pikachu, Wample, Bagon, Barnacle, Exeggutor, Healing Scarf, Shogun, Steven Reverse and Unpheasant Ancient Trait, so yeah, it looks like this box was in fact another 11 holo rare box, or holo, holo ultra rare box. But for the recap, I'll just go through these quickly in no particular order, just hollows them. Yeah, so I'm not, not the happiest about this final box, but we have Zekrom, Jirachi, Beautifly. Swellow, Zekrom, again. So yeah, so we got double ups of Zekrom too. Togekiss, Hydreigon, Thunderous, Shaman, Rayquaza EX, Colorless, and we have the Latios EX once again. So that's number three of those for the case. But either way, you guys, thank you for watching. Sorry about that last part of the video. I thought I would do that off camera. By the way, if you, if you like the video, make sure you hit the like button, comment, let me know what you think, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Thanks for watching.